guys, Kostinha here from Drone Lovers Channel. Today I'm doing this video to show you guys this uh, thing that I did for my bugs. So, I'm on vacation by the lake and uh, yesterday I was flying over the water and I was thinking, what if something happens and it goes down? What if my bugs goes down over the lake? I will lose it. It will go underwater and I will never see it again. So, I went on YouTube, watched a couple of videos about flotation devices for quadcopters and I found out these type of uh, landing gears for the Mavic that works as a flotation device. So, I decided to do my take on those type of uh, landing gears for the Mavic. And what I did was, I went to my local Chinese market or $1 store and bought four styrofoam balls. And then I got this um, PVC pipe, this type of pipe that goes uh, with the electric wires on the walls. It's about one inch, one inch in diameter. And I cut it four pieces with 10 centimeters. Then um, I grabbed the styrofoam balls and I shoved the tubes about three centimeters inside the ball so it doesn't go all the way it goes like three quarters more or less probably two thirds inside the ball and then applying heat i molded the other side of the the pvc pipe so it fitted the the landing gear on the bugs so this is how i did my flotation device for my bugs so now we are going to do an experiment. I haven't tried it yet. I know that it floats because I tried it on my bathtub, but now I'm using my nephew's uh, swimming pool to try and land the bugs on it. So wish me luck and hopefully everything goes well. Let's go guys. So guys, let me show you on detail how uh, the feet that I did are. So this was molded with heat. I used uh, a lighter, simple lighter, just to heat this part of the, the tube uh, to shape it, shape it to the same shape as the smaller feet on the bugs. And between the tube and the styrofoam ball, I used hot glue just for them to stay in place. So when you mold uh, the this piece of the ball of the pipe sorry you must be sure to mold it a little bit tighter than the actual size of the feet so they would stay snugged in there and as you can see they all fit very well some of them probably a little bit tighter than others doesn't matter if you put them there there's no correct leg for each because they're all the same so in case you're wondering that's my return to Kostinha if found <laughs> a sticker over there so this is how he looks with the flotation landing gear it can still uh, take a camera, but when it lands, I have to take out of my tripod. But there's no, I think there's no space, enough space for the camera because, uh, because of the weight of the, um, of the quad and the battery, the water level goes about more than halfway uh, on the ball. So now, I'm going to land my bugs inside my nephew's swimming pool. Hopefully it will go okay. So let's do it. So here we are guys. I'm going to take off right in front of the swimming pool, go over and land it inside the water. So hopefully everything goes well. Wish me luck. And it floats. 
as you can see it's floating there's no problems careful with the edge of the swimming pool but now I will try to take off let me just no problem there It works! <laughs> so, as you can see, no water on the bugs, probably just a couple of splashes, but no major water. So, this is a success. Uh, this is a success. <clears throat> this is success in my book. <laughs>